What is up? What is up, everybody? This is the very first episode in the year-end series of awards and shows. This is the 2023 year-end series that I do every year for the past 15 years. Um, and we are going to be doing some different ones this year. We're going to kick it off with a new one. Um, a new one for the series. And of course, on New Year's Eve, as tradition, because this series goes all the way through November, through December, on Christmas Eve, we're going to have the game of the year. And 2023 is the most insane year for gaming. It may go down in history as the most biggest year we've seen as gamers, without a doubt. Um, it may seem cliche, like we've said this before, but this time is the truth. And it's becoming neck and neck with the winners. We are going to be doing a top 20 because there's just too many to make the cut. And it would be just a bunch of honorable mentions. So we're just going to do the top 20. When I get down to the final five or three, Four, we're going to be doing elimination. Then when it gets down to the final three, we're going to kick the third one off. And then it comes down to the last two. Um, it's going to be like, a, you know, a big event. We're going to have indies. We're going to have music album of the year and a couple new ones. We're going to have my channel year end review series. We're going to have What's coming on this uh, channel next year? Most anticipated games of 2024. So you better stick around. It's going to go all the way through Christmas. And we got Christmas Spectacular 2023 uh, with lots of vlogs and fun events. We got all brand new games and streams over on Twitch. Twitch.tv backslash Murray and Jay And we got the biggest giveaways of the year. The biggest giveaways of the year. Everything is going to be in its own playlist. So please check the playlists out. Okay? All right. Franchises that need a big return. Let's kick off 2023's year-end series awards with franchises that need to come back. And I made a list here, and I've been thinking about this. And I know I could have went on and on and on. But I thought of ones that I really want to return. And I don't just want to return either. Like some microtransaction filled garbage. I want a real return. I want these games to come back with a vengeance. And to kick that off with NBA Jam. We need a new NBA Jam. From downtown. Boom shakalaka. Sweet raspberry potato pie. Whoa he's on fire. We need Bill Clinton, Big Head Mode. We need Mark Turmel. We need NBA Jam to come back, okay? We need NBA Jam to come back in a big way. Uh, let it come out on the Switch. That's fine. Um, SSX, whether it be like Tricky 2 or just a brand new SSX, I think that... Seriously needs a return. Um, this, you know, it's a snowboarding game. We really haven't had one. But what was different and what set SSX apart from other snowboarding games was it was fun. It was different. Um, it was unique. The character stood out. And it was just craziness. The graphics were amazing. The music was amazing. We need an SSX to come back. So bring it back. Twisted Metal. You brought a TV show. From, you brought over a TV show on a Peacock of Twisted Metal. Where's the game? We need a Twisted Metal game. Um, and now with the PlayStation Portal... That would be awesome, uh, you know, to have a handheld, walk around with it when you're not in front of the TV. 
and bring all the guys back. Bring all the characters back. Maybe add a few new ones, all the classic venues, and just do like a almost like a Armageddon type style twisted metal. Come on. David Jaffe said he's waiting. NFL 2K and college football games also. The hell with this Madden crap. I know they got like a contract. But say we lived in a fantasy world. Okay? How about a good college game and how about NFL 2K comes back? Maybe some competition for Madden. Because you understand what's happening, right? The reason that Madden is the same every year, right? It's because there's no competition. What what do they have? What reason do they have? And especially when they have these whales, these idiot promotional channels that give thousands of dollars for their my player, they're never going to improve the game. We need competition. So, bring that back, okay? All right, moving on. Knockout Kings. We need a real good boxing game, but with everybody in it. Man, do you remember back in the day on the PlayStation, Knockout Kings? I remember some good ones on the GameCube. So, like, even a Knockout Kings on the Switch would be awesome. But a really full-fledged Knockout Kings with a ton of boxers in it, customization, online, the works. Jazz Jackrabbit. Now, some of you youngins might not know about this, but this is epic. You know, the same company that does Fortnite. Jazz Jackrabbit was a game that I used to play on the PC. Um, A very fun, amazing game. And I used to spend hours playing Jazz Jackrabbit. Well, guess what? Better ask around. Let people know about Jazz Jackrabbit. And Jazz Jackrabbit should make a return. And then what they should do is get all the old ones. I remember there was like a Christmas one. Remaster them or clean them up like they did Doom and Quake. Put them on a game, on a collection, and then put a new one out. I think that would be great. Even like a Jazz Jackrabbit on the Evercade would be awesome. All right. Duke Nukem. Yeah. Those alien bastards are going to pay for shooting up my ride. A brand new Duke Nukem, but in the style of like 3D. Duke Nukem 3D, like a like a first-person shooter Duke Nukem. A return to the classic Duke Nukem 3D. Um, all new dialogue, all new graphics engine. Man, don't go th- the route of Duke Nukem Forever even though I never had a problem with it. But make it really good. Take the time. Duke Nukem, a return. Duke Nukem Returns, or something like that. I think it'd be awesome. Uh, F-Zero, enough said. When is F-Zero going to come back? A brand new F-Zero. And Ridge Racer. Come on, Ridge Racer. One of my favorite racing games. One of my favorite fun Racing games, when you want a quick race or two in and out, you don't want nothing crazy like a simulator or nothing involved. Ridge Racer, a simple Ridge Racer. Make it real next gen, PlayStation 5, uh, and just have a ton of cars, ton of tracks. Have a customization mode and just tons of fun. Couch co-op, split screen, Ridge Racer. Guys, what franchise... What games would you like to come back? Um, Honorable Mention, Primal Rage, that fighting game. Battle Arena to Shinden, right? Leisure Suit Larry. Maybe a new Mist. Like a brand new Mist. With all new puzzles. Um, They brought back Seventh Guest VR, so that was cool. A police quest, brand new police quest. I'm going old school. So, write in the comments below, which games would you like to make a big return from a franchise that hasn't been seen in a long time? Take care, guys. Until the next year-end series of award shows, 
I will be back. Have yourself a good one. Take care.